hello friends welcome back uh, in this video tutorial I will continue on the tooltip so in my previous video we have seen how to apply the tooltip on the JavaFX controls so I will continue today uh, and applying the CSS on this tooltip so you will see all the steps with the help of a same example that I have taken in my previous video so if you have not seen that video so I will suggest you so just watch that video first and come back here and continue your learning so this was the code that we have developed in previous example so let me run this example I will show you what we have done so far this is the window where we have uh, set up the tooltip this is for the password field and this is for the button and this is for the checkbox now in this example uh, we will do the back we will do a change on the background color of the tooltip okay this is easy so just follow the instructions and you will be able to do that now close this stage come back here in the fxml document controller dot java file So as you can see, all we have done inside the initialize method. Okay, so we will continue coding inside the initialize method. So the first one is the tooltip object, class object is created. And then we set a text with the help of set text method. And then we connect this tooltip with the controls. Okay, to change the background color, we have to apply a CSS. So we have two way. The first one is we can create the separate CSS for that or we can directly do a small coding in the initialize method. So I am showing you uh, the second method where we will do a small uh, coding here inside the initialize method to set the background color for the tooltip. Okay, now see on the line number 55. For saving the time, I have already written this line of line of code. Okay. So uh, watch at line number fifty-five. So the object we have used the tooltip password. You can notice here the tooltip password is the object of tooltip class. And we are applying the CSS component on with the help of set style method. So this is another way you can directly apply the small CSS on it. Okay, so using the FX background color and setting this color to the brown. Okay, in the same way, I will apply for the button and for the checkbox as well. Okay, make sure you are taking, you are applying the set style method on the tooltip class object. Okay, watch at the line number 61. I'm just changing the color name. color name to green okay now here just paste it the tooltip object and apply the set style method and write the same code and the property fx background color and assign a color different color okay setting up color blue 
ओके ओके डन इट इज डन नाउ नाउ इट इज डन एंड जस्ट सेव इट सो वी हैव अप्लाइड दिस सेट स्टाइल मैथड एंड वी अप्लाइंग अ स्मॉल स्टाइलिंग सीज स्टाइल on these controls on the tool tip objects so the background color will be change okay now go to the run menu do a clean build okay go to the tool tip example class file and just run it and you will see here go to the password field now you see that the tool tip is background color is brown as we expected it is looking really nice and come to this button uh, yeah it's good uh, we have the background color is green and now on the checkbox yeah it's really good which has a neat blue color so this was the example uh, this was the process steps you can change the background color of the tool tip if you have any doubt so please comment below i will try to reply as soon as possible that's all guys i hope you enjoyed this video so please like and subscribe my channel and press the notification bell icon for new video updates thanks for watching